Dear Gemini, your tarot card for this week, August 9th to August 15th, is Seven of Pentacles. The Seven of Pentacles represents perseverance in your occupation or business. It is associated with success but through slow, steady growth. It suggests that you will have to wait a long time for your reward and that perhaps you are not working at your full potential. This week you might find yourself simply working and waiting. You've been trying hard but it probably feels like there's little to show for it. Keep your chin up. You are actively creating change in your life, but it takes time. Try not to get down on yourself while the process continues. Commitment means sticking through the dull, tough times to reach your goal. You're well on your way and it would be a shame not to keep going. In fact, the hardest part now is not to give up for fear of failure. There's still work ahead but you're going in the right direction. Keep plugging away and you will succeed. Now is the opportunity to stand side by side with a little patience and stop activities and solve any concerns, intellectual or emotional conflict. Trust yourself. Your behavior and moods of behavior should be positive and full of hope and expectation. Accept and courage of those who believe in you. Soon you will see the growth of the fruits of your efforts. This card encourages you to use your money, time and energy in the direction of your beliefs and respect your commitments. Love and private life. With regard to love, the seven of pentacles points to things going well for the person that you have your heart set on. If you are not in a committed relationship, you need to be open to other possibilities, however. None of us have just one person that is the only person that we can be with and have a deep, soulful, happy relationship. Don't give in to feelings of suspicion or fear. All is well. Work and social life. Your work is likely to be going smoothly and you will be reaping the rewards of past efforts, what is happening now or in the immediate future will be a direct result of what you have done in the past. Your finances are likely to be flowing well, you may not be rolling in money but you will certainly have enough. Finances. This card is an excellent omen for finances. You are likely to have invested wisely, either in terms of traditional investments or in terms of your time and energy. This is not a time to gamble, however. Being conservative and thoughtful about where you put your resources, especially newfound resources, is key. Health. You are reaping the results of your past behavior. It's never too late to improve this, however. Today sows the seeds of your tomorrow, very often. Examine your belief system. Do you see yourself as someone who is sick, or someone who is filled with health? Even if you are stressed to the utmost regarding your time and energy, you can take two seconds out of your day to think positively. Spirituality. You will be focused on the reality that life is cyclical, and that what goes around always, without fail, will come around. Remember that when you make a point to be generous, whether with time, energy, or money, that too is an investment in your own future. Share what you have. Accept gratefully what you are given. If you resonate with this reading, don't forget to subscribe.